Recently, there is a hashtag which is trending on Twitter. It is called All Eyes on Bangladeshi Hindus. How I understand the situation. However, being a citizen of Bangladesh, I would like to clarify the misinformation. Misinformation number one. If you're looking at this picture over here, it is being instigated through captions that a minority group, more specifically a Hindu, has been and this is her clothing. That is not the case. Recently, the Prime Minister of Bangladesh has resigned and the general people stormed in her residence. And this is actually her clothing. And misinformation number two, it is being instigated that again, a minority is being beaten to death. That is not the case. This person is a political leader. In many parts of Bangladesh, miscreants are trying to harm minorities in Bangladesh. However, the students of Bangladesh have taken upon themselves to protect them. Because as you can see in this picture, Student volunteers have gathered together to protect all the minorities, including Hindu temples, churches, multiple households. And not only that, including if you look at this picture, this person is Hujur. He is also defending the minority group. And not only that, also in all the local mosques, Imams are coming and announcing in the mic to protect all the minorities because there are some miscreants who are trying to take advantage in this entire situation because this has become more of a geopolitics. So please, it is my request, do not let anyone take advantage of this situation. Because if you want the real scenario in Bangladesh, the students are doing a wonderful job. As before, we would suffer from heavy traffic. If you look at it right now, traffic is finally coordinated. There is actually an emergency lane, which we never had before. At the same time, there were multiple cases where there was a lot of looting. But students, right as of this moment, are trying their very best to reach each and everything that was looted and not only that there was a lot of looting right after but the students made sure all the money was returned as you can see here again and I would request everyone to use this hashtag to see what is actually going on in Bangladesh and do not let anyone take advantage of this Bangladesh 2.0